I'm gonna show you how to use the new 93 rated Adama Charori. This is from Wolverhamptons, obviously. Let's go. Be sure to subscribe to my channel as I upload new PES 2020 mobile content every week. Don't forget to turn on a post notification and leave a nice comment down below as that helps to keep me motivated. So I opened the new Premier League MVP pack. And to be completely honest, I wasn't expecting to get anybody at all because most of the stats for most persons don't really look that good. But lo and behold, I opened the League One pack and I got a couple of decent players, you know. And then I said, you know what, let me spend some of the coins on the Premier League pack. So I opened the pack and I got Adam Traore. I got some other players as well like Van Dyke and Leno. But, you know, you already know that not really much to say about those persons if you want me to review them just tell me but let's get onto the topic now you guys know that i'm one of the most honest youtubers out there and i'm gonna tell you the god honest truth this card to me is a joke let me explain why yes we know that he's one of the strongest and fastest um players in the world and you know his speed is 99 acceleration 99 his dribbling is 98 because you know he's dribbled past so many defenders in the prem so you know of course konami is gonna give him good ratings but when you look at the rest of his stats especially for a right wing forward you have to wonder if konami is having a laugh at us you have to wonder if konami is just wanting us to waste coins because this is the only logical reason that i have firstly for a right wing forward, his offensive awareness is 77. Let me repeat that. His offensive awareness is 77. His low pass is 76. His lofted pass is 83. His finishing, finishing. Keep in mind, he's a prolific winger. This means that he tends to cut in and go central and take shots. What kind of man with 77 finishing is going to come in and take shots? That does that make any sense to you? His heading is 72 and his place kicking is 72. His curl is 75. Bro, bro, let's be real. Kicking power 84. That's not so bad. Jump 82. Balance and physical contact. Those are expected. His balance is 94 and his physical contact is 96. So that's not bad. Stamina is 84. Come on. The center mid forward, the 17 year old center mid forward from the League One pack has 94 stamina. And you need to tell me that Adam Traore, one of the fastest players in the Prem, one of the strongest players in the Prem, one of the fittest players in the Prem, only has 84 stamina. This means that he's probably not even going to last the entire match. That doesn't make any sense to me. He, his skills, keep in mind, he's filled with skills, but he doesn't have any long range drive shots. He doesn't have any curling ability. He doesn't have any heading. He doesn't have any pinpoint crossing. He doesn't have any weighted passing. He doesn't have any through passing. He doesn't even have captaincy for crying out loud. He just has scissors faint, martial turn, gamesmanship, heel trick, flip flop. Yeah, you can use him to dribble through the entire feet. But when you take a shot, what's gonna happen? You're gonna have a 50-50 chance. When you take a cross, what's gonna happen? Like I've used him and i've crossed about 10 balls with him in one match and only one of them were on target and yeah maybe it didn't score maybe it did i can't remember but you'll see it in this clip but trust me adam achari no he is not it like you know sometimes i look on certain players like i'd look on rashford or other players and say konami isn't putting out the right stats as in don't feel bad about the stats they still play good in game this player is trash in game and if you guys haven't realized for me at least every single time that i start him he's always on either brown or red and i'm like what bro his conditioning is poor or his condition trend is poor he i haven't seen him on form all now and i've played 15 games with him maybe it's different from you guys but trust me this is a whole different ball game for me <laughs> it's it's not that i don't know uh the crossing is poor what i do is i just be my overlapping um wing back coming in and cross the ball Kafu, you know, or we Bisaka, anybody who can actually cross a ball properly. This man was is only one defender in front of Cristiano Ronaldo and he still couldn't find Cristiano Ronaldo. Not even ground passes are working. I'm crossing and he's passing it straight to the keeper. From an angle that Rashford is right in front of him. Like it's a straight line to Rashford. Yet still it goes at an angle and goes straight to the keeper. 
this one can even be used in set pieces he cannot be used for the heading in set pieces he cannot be used for corners he cannot be used for free kicks he cannot be used for long free kicks short free kicks he cannot even be used for penalties his stats are so horrible it's not even funny his penalty i think is 60 something or 70 at most his free kick short free kick ability is 73 that's poor i don't even know what is happening for this card right now it is poor and yes you see in this clip that i score a free kick yeah that's one out of the one million that i will ever take with this card not that i will ever take another um free kick with this card but i'm just saying you don't expect to score much don't expect because i scored from that regular easy angle that he's going to score bro this card is trash he doesn't have any shooting skills like this is probably one of the first cards that i've actually you know decided to say yo let me review and you know try to see what type of card no this is horrible i mean trust me the card can improve next season but as it relates for this season because usually usually the featured card is like a reflection of what the stats may be for next year you know obviously you know take off like a five off for each so let's say if he's finishing his um 77 and it's probably gonna be like 74 in best 2021 you know because feature player is kind of op but this feature player is no p <laughs> he's not op but yeah this is just my honest opinion on adam Achari. tell me if you get him down below and tell me if you guys use him the thing is he can be used he can be used to do regular things that you do directly forward but he cannot curl he cannot take shots nothing at all he can probably pass a couple balls properly and well can shift out the field i do not deny that he can shift out the field but apart from that he's pretty trash in my opinion tell me what you guys think about him down in the comment section smash that like button smash that subscribe button road to 800 i'm out